and just like that we are 82 fletching <laughs> fletching can't even pronounce it right sorry guys early in the morning got 81 earlier forgot to record it as that's what i just said early in the morning my brain's still coming online wow one more click and i actually would have missed it almost blew it 83 fletching coming in there Okay, so one more to go and we can actually make Dragon Bolts. So that what we're trying to do right now, guys, is Dragon Bolts are level 84. So I figured out just through like, just through sheer luck pretty much, just looking at the G prices, I'm like, I wonder if you actually don't lose any money making the bolts. They're a little bit less XP than Addy Darts. You lose about, from level 80 to 99, you lose about 44, 45 mil doing Addy Darts. If I can do Dragon Bolts and get a little bit less XP, which I don't really care about because it's already insane XP, like, like insanely quick. Um, I can go all the way to 99 with pretty much losing no money or even making money. So depending on how the prices stay. So that's what I'm just trying to do now. I'm trying to rush to get 84 and cash in on this. Because guys, when you have opportunities like this, you got to take them. because They don't come around very often. I'm really going to miss one of these levels. That's the second time I caught it right as I stopped. I got the level just by coincidence. So definitely going to miss a couple of them in the future. So we got 84 now. We can now make the Dragon Bolt. So... Oh, Am Amethyst Javelin, that's pretty cool. Uh, we just gotta buy him from the GE, and hopefully we won't be losing any money when making these. That'd be awesome, 84 fletching. I did this in about, I went from 80 to 84 fletching in about two hours just by doing dart, lift, dart tips, it's so quick. Like, let's see if it, if it shows the XP here, actually. Uh, oh, no, oh, look, XP per hour, 347k XP gained. XP gained. I gained, I gained 900k XP already. That's insane. Oh man, my finger is killing me. I made sure I didn't miss this one. 85 fletching. Boom, 72 mining. Just needed to get that up because it was just close to a level. That's the only reason why I wanted to get it up. 1996 total level, four levels away. 45k till farming is up, so I'm probably gonna go buy some magic seeds, plant the trees, I'll be ready tomorrow. So that's 82 farming. And fletching is still on the way. We got a ton of bolts more to make. So we'll get that to 86 and we'll be to 2k total soon, hopefully. Yes, 86 fletching. 87 fletching. Almost missed that one too. I don't want to miss it. There it is, 88 flexion. Well, guys, I blew it. I knew I was going to miss one, but I didn't know I was going to miss the most important one. We got 89 fletching down here, and now we have reached, finally, after years and years, 2,000 total. So we can use the 2,000 total world. It's a great milestone. And I missed it both on the recording, of course. So <laughs> let's go and check out these worlds, see if how many people are at the GE. I think it's 351, actually. Is Oh, no, 349. Okay, 349. Let's do it. First time ever logging into the 2K totals. Oh wow, there's actually a lot of, uh, not really that many people here. So boy, I'm pretty sure this guy's like, uh, makes videos and shit, I'm almost certain. Makes uh, made a lot of videos on Twistable Re. <laughs> I already love this world, this is hilarious. Perfect, 50K XP drop, 90 cooking. Dark crabs, and I think those are the raids, fish and bats. There she is, 90 fletching. We're getting into the... No, we can make dragon arrows now. Awesome. We're getting into the higher levels now, guys. It's going to start slowing down. 90 fletching, 90 cooking. 2002 total. Yeah, this is where it's going to start to get a little bit rough. 91 cooking. 92 fletching. There we go. Halfway. Damn it, I just missed the level. Missed another one. Hopefully, don't miss anymore. 93 fletching right there. Almost actually missed this one too. 93 cooking. Hey, 94 fletching. 94 cooking. Nice. 95 cooking. Four more levels. Summer pies. I think that's the highest level thing you can make in the game. 96 cooking. 97 cooking. Two more levels to go. 98 cooking, one more level to go. There it is, 99 cooking. Nice fireworks, I haven't seen those before. They added those in, they're pretty nice. 99 cooking, we're finally done. We can go get the skill cave, we can do everything in the skill now. All we have left to do is bang fletching out of the way, then we'll have both those knocked out, we can go back to PVMing. Yes sir, give me one of those skill capes. 
And there we go, cooking skill cave. I don't know what the perk of this does. Maybe it just doesn't let you burn the food as much or something. I don't really know. But nonetheless, we got it. We are a master cooker now. So let's go to fletching and get that figured out. 95 fletching. There it is, 96 meat. Oh, I almost said smithing for some reason. Fletching. There it is. 97 fletching. We are two levels away. 98 fletching. One more level to go. There we go. 99 fletching. Look at those fireworks. We're finally done. The grind is over. So we can now buy the fletching skill cave. Let's get one of these right here. That is a beautiful, I always liked this cape. I always thought it was a really good one. Search, what does it do? Oh, you may search the cape twice more today. Oh, that's pretty cool. I had no idea if it even did that. Give you a crossbow and a uh, grapple. That's actually pretty cool. Not really, I don't know where it'd be that useful, but pretty neat. Look at that cape, that's beautiful. And there is level 81 herb lore coming in. What is this garbage on the floor? Hey, 82 herb lore. 83 herb lore two more levels to go and we are done 84 herb lore so finally i can actually make these potions without boosting because i've been using a boost the whole time and keeping preserve on to make these so for some reason i was under the assumption that you could only upgrade these from a three dose potion and i was doing that the whole time and getting a lot less xp 85 herb lore finally so we can actually boost now to finish off the Varrock elite dyers if we want but we still need to get some smithing levels 82 wood cutting completely afk did that's all i do and i come to woodcut i just edit my videos and then like i afk and get some levels so i just wanted to talk about what i've been doing on the last couple weeks on my account here so as you've seen earlier, I got 99 cooking and fletching, and I got 85 herbler, which in total ran me about 45 mil just to get all of those, to get the 299s and the herbler, which was actually kind of expensive the way I was doing it, because I didn't realize I wasn't doing it properly. But anyways, what I'm doing now is I'm just going back to PVMing. I'm gonna start making some money again so I can get back on this Tebow grind. I just uh, saw an opportunity to get those 99s because of uh, Borcat and all the items were crashing because of them, all the resources so i just i had the money there i was like okay you know what i'm just gonna go for this and the best part is about getting your skills up is you never have to get them up again once you get them so they're out of the way permanently so what i'm planning on doing right now is i'm gonna go back to pbm start saving up some money i'm pretty sure i haven't decided 100 percent, but i think what i'm gonna do is when i have enough i'm gonna sell everything in my bank just including the pots and all that stuff that essentials you need to keep i'll just sell all my gear that i have I'm probably going to buy an Ellie Elijah Spirit Shield and just rebuild with that because I, th I honestly, I really think that it's going to be useful in Theater of Blood and I've already been, I've been keeping close eye on it and it's been going up the last month and a half so I kind of want to grab one before it gets too expensive so I can't afford it anymore. So probably going to do that. Maybe I might get some, if I have some extra money lying around, which I probably will not. But if I do, I might get 86 smithing just because it's a great, really good skill to have only reason being is because smithing for some reason is used in almost every freaking diary so i'll get that to 86 if i can if i have some money lying around which i probably won't but if i do it would be nice to get some more elite diaries out of the way and that's me not getting a pet again for the 29th cape trade-in <laughs> well if you made it all the way to the end thank you for watching the video leave a like down below comment on what you want to see happening in the future subscribe to my channel if you only if you enjoy this content if you don't enjoy it don't subscribe then but I'm gonna go try to get some zenite shards here and i will see you guys in the next video have a good one